Welcome to the channel, everybody. It's me, RP. Thank you so much for joining me and letting me steal some of your time. I'm checking out Internet Cafe Supermarket Simulator 2024. Wow, right? That's a lot. It's brand new. I, I mean, it's brand new to me. I just found it on Steam. Uh, came across my radar. I said, let me see what this is all about. So I played for a little bit, guys. I'm going to be honest with you, but we are going to start a new game here. Let's go ahead and drop that uh, big head of mine down into the corner here. I'm going to call it RP Gaming. And I'm just going to go ahead and confirm this. And we'll start a new game. I wanted to get into the game for a little bit. I had to stop at day three. I said, I got to record an episode. All right, let me hit escape here. And I start off in my little, uh, my little room here. So this game, unlike Supermarket Simulator, guys, and I've never played Cafe Simulator. So I, I don't know what that's all about. But in this one, we have a health bar. Uh, we also have a hunger bar. We have a thirst bar. And we do have an energy bar. All right, so we've got some personal, uh, you know, some personal stats that we need to be aware of. We need to take care of. But uh, we head right out here. And this is the town. And the town has absolutely no vehicle traffic. It's all foot traffic, which I love. It's a very small little town here. You know, you know how these games go. And we're going to go ahead and turn this on here, open up the door. And I'm going to run us through the tutorial as quickly as possible. So basically, we need to step in here, hit our tab. We need to go buy tools. So everything is very close by. This is We, we buy everything right here from this convenience store, at least these items. We're going to buy food here, and we can buy our trash can and our broom. And we need five of these bags. And in order to give your uh, cafe a fresh look, you'll need to buy the roller brush. We're going to hold off on that right now. But that is how you get it to look less concrete. All right, that's what it looks like right now. Okay, so that takes care of that. Uh, what else do we need to do? We need to go back and clean up the store. Let's do that real quickly. So we're going to hit our tab, obviously, like in all games. And we're going to pick our trash can and we're going to throw all of this stuff right into the garbage get this done as quickly as possible but like you see how everything looks like it's concrete the walls uh the floor that 250 dollar roller brush is what's going to allow you to change that uh, obviously that's going to cost you per square that you paint uh, but that's how we're going to get it to look good at some point in the game. But for right now, we're just going to do this. All right, so that's done. Let me go ahead and pick up the trash, throw it away. Right there, bang. Try to breeze through this tutorial. You know, we all know how these tutorials are, but you have to do them. All right, now what's uh, next? Open the web browser, and we need to go to the eBay market. So let's go here. Computer starts up. And then we just press any key and we're going to go to the web browser and go to eBay market. I really, really love this. This is so cool. So I'm going to buy uh, one setup because that's what, it, you know, we're going to follow the tutorial. And then once the tutorial lets us go, we will buy a couple of more computers. But for right now, first setup is $408. We'll go ahead and buy that get out of this and i also want to get out of this i want to get always get back to this screen now my uh my camera is hiding but right on the bottom right here is how you open the shop it's just a button you click it and it opens and closes the shop uh, i should probably move myself out of the way but it's too late now what do you expect from a from a from a rookie sitting in Boston playing video games for you guys, okay? There's the chair, there's the the keyboard, there's the mouse, the monitor, the table, and we'll pick the table up since we can't get to that box. Use your left mouse button and your middle mouse button to spin things around, and what I do is go back as far as I can and to the right and then come out and then give it just a little scooch of air. Just a little scooch of air. So the next tables line up. Go ahead and throw this on top of this one. This is going to be our first workstation. And like I said, what I'm going to do is get four of them down. 
once we get through uh, the tutorial. But this is what we have to do to get things going. And as you can see, pretty easy to do this. I'm going to build that just like that. And uh, let me grab this chair. Throw this chair down. Got to use this plastic yard chair, folks. Sorry. Probably not that comfortable, but, uh, you know, you got to walk before you run. You got to crawl before you walk. All right, so let's put this down. I love this, though. I think this is a really cool game. You guys let me know what you think. Don't forget, if you're enjoying this, please do me a favor and always hit that like button for me. I would really appreciate it. Trying to hit that 3,000 mark with the help of uh, sim enthusiasts like yourselves. And, uh, yeah, that way, uh, basically, if I can get the channel a little bit bigger, when I get keys from Keymailer, I can get keys to give out as well. But I got to get a little bit bigger. I'm a little bit too small. I'd like to be big enough to get you guys keys, basically. All right, so now we're going to open up uh, the... Uh, store so I'm hitting that button that you can't see but trust me it's there you'll see it when you play the game it's right there if you look right there you can see the green button and now we are open and that's it we're done now we have to approve this person got to go to our network managing system screen and we got to approve them but what I want to do is I want to do the automatic uh, purchase uh, the automatic, I want to purchase this. This will automatically let them log on, but I can't do that just yet. So we're just going to back out of here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to let this person continue. I just turn the store off. So I'm going to let them finish, but I don't want any more customers. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to let this person fulfill the tutorial of opening the store. And then now we have to do another tutorial, which is pay attention to our body. But let's get this person out of here real quick. There you go. Because what I want to do is I want to actually put down... Got to get the garbage can out. And you have to do this stuff. You got to keep it clean. All right, just like in all of these games, right? Doesn't matter where you are. If you hit T, you can make this little menu right here. Open and close right under the clock. But let's head over to here because now we need to get rid of this quest. Oh, this is basically letting us know we got to eat. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm not really hungry right now, but I am going to put it in my backpack. And I'll grab a hamburger for later. Put that in the backpack. And now we have something to satisfy thirst, give us energy, and something to eat. So that's good. But what I want to do is before we open up again, we want to get at least... All right, we have 1,400. I want to get... Let me close this. I want to get some more. I want to get some more tables. I want to get some more computers set up. So we're going to buy one, two. Uh, let's see. It's 400, 400. I think we can do this. Let's try. Two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Two, three. And up, two. Three. Let me make sure I have everything here. I have three tables, three chairs, three computers. I have six monitors. I don't need that. Vintage mouse, three. I need the keyboards, folks. Let's get the keyboard. Here we go. One, two, and three. So that should be right. Let me just double check here real quick. Three, three, and three. Twelve hundred dollars. That's good. Leaves us with a hundred and eighty-nine dollars. And we're going to get a very large delivery here. So let's get out of the way. This guy's coming around the corner. I wish it's stacked on a pallet right here instead of just wildly being thrown into the street. But hey, it is what it is. There it is. Look at that. All right. Very good. Let's go ahead and open up all this stuff. Every time we find a table, we'll we'll take advantage of that and we'll get rid of it. It's going to look a little ugly until we get this built, folks. But uh, yeah, it'll be worth it. All right. That kind of shifted. I don't like that. 
I don't like that. I want you to stay. Yeah, just like that. Looks good. All right, let's keep up. Uh, we can take the chairs. I'll put the chairs down. Let's set this up really quick, guys. This is going to be our first, uh, our first uh, money loop. We'll get four of these going. All right, actually, I think what I'll do is I'll do this. I'm going to put this one here. Flip it around, and we're going to use this as a guide. And just come out just a little bit, a little bit back, right there. All right, and what do we got here? What do we got here? Monitors, computers, another chair. Let's go ahead and grab that. And we're going to put that right like this. And... Another table. Perfect. And this table I'm going to put just like this. Just like that. Perfect. Oh, I need a chair. Right there. That should be all three of the chairs. Everything else should be the computers and everything we need. All right, looks good. Let's go ahead and open up this last box. Let's grab monitors. Throw these monitors up here. This is probably going to have to come forward like that. Now the next monitor needs to fit directly behind this one. And hopefully... Perfect. I want to get it as straight looking as possible. My OCD, my Vergonian ways. There we go. Grab you. Get you on here, just like that. Let's go grab some PCs. I think we opened everything, right? I believe we did. All right, I'm gonna put you on the right-hand side. Keep everything, I mean, to the left. We'll keep that to the left. Grab this PC. And put that right here as well. Looking good, looking good. Looking, looking good. All right, and then we're going to we're going to take a bank loan out. And the reason why I want to take the bank loan out is cuz I want to be able to uh, enable automatic access to the network so that I don't have to keep uh, turning on permission in order for this to uh, to work. This way I can do other things, and this is what I like about the game is uh, if you earn the money you can use it to help uh, upgrade the uh, the store to where you don't have to take any money you don't have to turn on anything it'll all happen automatically and it'll just start cranking out cash for us which is going to help us reach our goal of peeling back the onion on this game and seeing how far we can go this is a early access game I am following the Discord in my own Discord. And by the way, if you'd like to join my Discord, I will have a link in the description. I always do that. It is the left mouse button. Don't do it with the right mouse button because you will upset uh, the apple cart. And I don't want to upset the apple cart. There we go. All right, it's getting dark. Got one more mouse to put here. Who does not have a mouse? You do not have a mouse. All right. Oh, okay. You know what we got to do? We got to place this here. And then this gets placed here. Just like that. Perfect. Everybody should have what they want. All systems go, folks. There's four systems right there. We got a couple of more things to do. Then we're going to open this bad boy up. We're going to go ahead and buy a lamp. I'm going to buy the $70 one because it's only $20 more than the, uh, than the worst one. Did I buy that? Let me see. I can't remember. Did I buy that? Yes, I did buy it. All right. So that should be showing up here. Hopefully. Did I put it in the cart, folks? Did I buy it? I don't think I did. I don't think I did. My mistake. 
My mistake. Lamps. Cart. Purchase. There we go. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go over to the bank. I'm going to borrow $1,000 and close that out. And then I'm going to go over here to the network system and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to adjust the prices right here using the adjust price in bulk. And I'm just going to back it off until it's suitable. Get as much money as we can. $18.85. Automatic approval. I'm buying that. Engaging that. The next thing we're going to shoot for is automatic cashier. $2,400. We have a little, little ways to go. That's not happening in the first episode. But I think we're off to a good start. I'm going to open. Back out of here. Day one has already started. I believe we paid our bills. Let's make sure. I cannot remember where the bills get paid, but... Oh, right here. They get paid here. We do have automatic bills right there. All right, automatic deduction. I don't know why we had to turn that back on, but we did. And now we are running. We are open. We need to put our light up so that our, our clientele can see what they're doing. Oh, by the way, you can punch in this game. Be very careful. If you use your, uh, uh, what is it, the uh, right mouse button, you will end up punching. And you can actually hurt somebody. Turn on the light. The light is on. There we go. So we still have to take money, but that's better than having to always constantly authorize use for these computers. I think that loan was, was worth taking. We should be able to make enough money with four of these now to get ourselves out of the bank loan debt and on our way to uh, getting another two setups going right here. So that's going to be the goal. So I am going to just sit back here, everybody, and I am going to collect money. I'm going to stay open. And as you can see here, I have 58% on my stomach and 49 on my thirst. And I am a little less than three quarters of the way tired. It is 2.35 in the morning. You do not have to shut down anything. You can just stay open. And like I said, once we have the ability to automatically collect money we won't even have to be here we can go home and get sleep if we want to the place will run as long as we have somebody in here that can clean it and we're willing to pay them for that but for right now i think we're off to a good start you guys let me know what you think about this cafe supermarket simulator 2024 Thanks a lot, everybody. I'm going to just continue to grind away here, and I will probably be recording back-to-back -back episodes. So do me a favor. Hit that like button. Don't forget, drop a few comments. Let me know what you think about this. I'm looking for new games to, uh, to try to get a full playthrough on. This game looks like we could get a lot done with it, and uh, I'm very excited for it. So if you guys want to see more, again, don't forget, hit the like button, and I will catch you the next episode. Ta-ta, and bye-bye.